Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the counselor's office. I'm Mr. Gaming Counselor, and we are back with some more Ascendant Challenge Bounty. That's right, the ultimate final shape bounty prep. We are here trying to get the second to last because Bay of Drowned Wishes or Chamber of Starlight. One of those two, you we're going to have to do on the week of the final shape, which is fine because you just do it, get the free XP, and call it a day. But we're going to do Harbinger Seclude today. I already got the bounty. Petra's right over there. If you really want to know, here we are. Petra's here. We're about to go forward in this area over here. So I'm just going to go. Work. I'm going to show you how to get there from here. Uh, Skimmer is gang gang because we're just going to hop over everything now. I have not gone through this. And yes, I know there's stairs, but I refuse to use stairs. Okay, never mind. Skimmer still struggles with bigger ledges don't worry i feel like that all the time as a short person sag skimmer gang short gang hashtag i'm sad i actually haven't been through this area in a long time it's so long like half the time i forget this is even here and they've used it in different content like they've used it for i think the coil Oh, well, that's not what I actually wanted to do, but that's fine. We're just going to go ahead and kill everything so we don't have any issues being shot at. I forgot this was like a mini challenge because there's going to be more trash. Nope, we're good. All right. So, again, you're always going to want your tinctures. You're going to pop. You can buy these from Petra. And there we are. We're just going to go. I remember when I first did this, I kept dying. I kept falling and dying because I would take damage and I was dumb. I was also trying to like speed run because I thought Ascendancy was not going to last long. Can I summon? Dang it. I thought we could summon sparrows from here. They thought of it. Wait a minute. Just for science. Okay, never mind. I was going to see if I could hop on the head and then summon a sparrow. You know, try to cheese the juice out of it. Also, a sword would be really good for this. Because if you're trying to, like, get the time, you have to kind of, like, blitz through this. And I think even strand sorting would be, like, great. All right, we're going to go in. If I remember correctly. We're going to... I'm just going to tether. Because there's nothing that's going to be beneficial to us right now. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be real honest. There was nothing there. I, I'm going to... I don't... I bet. 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 On the floor. Don't use grenade launchers, apparently. Don't use grenade launchers. Apparently, you're going to hit invisible things. I guess the dome, the little ritual circle, has a wide, wide hitbox. So there, don't use grenade launchers. Or if you do, don't be around the, the big ritual circle, stupid. Don't be stupid like me, stupid. Ah, I miss doing this where I slowly lose my... <gasps> I jumped without meaning to. Where you lose your insanity by the way i'm i'll probably complete this on normal time which is like five or six minutes <laughs> that's usually what the pro pro typical i think the max is maybe 10 or at least empire hunts are like 10 minutes it doesn't take long to do this but it also is really easy to kind of waste your time by being stupid like me all right we're just just take out the freaking wizards See, I don't have to be crazy. Using base crap works. Just be smart. I'm also keeping uh, Devourer open just because. Thank you. Which one's going to get it? You can kind of... Devour, still procking, juiced. Yeah, with Devour, you don't have to worry about dying. 
Easy. All right. Now you want to follow Tolan. And there you go. Also, don't get yourself killed by uh, swinging off the ledge. Remember, you can sword swing. Do sword swing. Be wary of boopers. But your biggest threat is the stupid off-screen rocks. Honestly, that's what will kill you. Sword swinging around the map. All right. It's very important you quickly grab if you're trying to do the time. And then you go out the portal if you're wanting to get time. It's that easy. Even with a goof up, you have plenty of time. I'm keeping it all in there just so you see in five minutes, even with a goof up and me literally killing myself, you can easily get what you need done. Hit that like button. Again, if you're wanting this for yourself, the link will be down below. I did change it so you have planetary bounty checklist instead of Vanguard and all that. Banshee still works. Nimbus, those bounties still work because you get the milestone. But since I did this on Hunter, I did Harbinger Seclude. Boop. There we go. One more next week, and then it's the final shape. Link for you down below. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel for more. As always, until next time, don't forget to game out.